Hi, welcome to Let's Learn English YouTube channel. My name is Sitwende Faswo. The focus of today's discussion is going to be on two varieties of the English language. British English and American English. There are so many words used in these varieties of the English language to mean the same thing. Let's get started. To the first one. When you are referring to the cover over the engine of a car, it's known as a bonnet. Bonnet in British English. Whereas Americans refer to it as a hood. Hood. To the next one. But when you are referring to the part of a car, where luggage, bags, and other things are kept, it's known as a but. Whereas Americans refer to it as a trunk. Trunk. To the next one. Holiday. Holiday is used in British English to refer to different things. One. Holiday is used to refer to a day set aside to commemorate a particular event. Two. Holiday is also used to refer to a period away from work. Vacation. Americans use vacation to refer to a period away from work. So when you're using holiday to refer to a period away from work, you're using British English. And when you're using vacation to refer to a period away from work, you're using American English. However, the two of them make use of holiday to refer to a day set aside to commemorate a particular event. Although it's mostly referred to as a public holiday in British English. To the last one for today. Car park. An outdoor building or place designed to park cars is known as a car park in British English. Whereas Americans refer to it as a parking lot. Parking lot. So when you decide to use bonnet, but to refer to different parts of a car, you simply use in British English. And when you decide to use hood and trunk to refer to different parts of a car, you are using American English. When you use holiday to mean a period away from work, you are using British English. And when you decide to use vacation to mean a period away from work, you're using American English. So the last one for today, car park. When you're referring to a place, an outdoor building designed to park cars is known as a car park in British English. Whereas Americans refer to such a place as a parking lot. Parking lot. Thanks so much for joining me on this episode. See you next time. Bye.